I like to play with symbolism a lot. And I felt that the library is just like a geode. As everybody knows, a geode, when you look from outside, it looks like just any other rock. But if you open it up, you go inside, you will find many, 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 many millions of gemstones in there. And it's the same thing with the library. If you look at the building, it's just like any other building. But if you walk inside the library, you will find many books. And uh, those are books of knowledge. And I compare that to the gemstones. As you read the books, as you go to the library, go through the internet, you will learn. And the gemstones act as the stepping stone to the knowledge. And so they are traveling from the geode to the treasure chest or from the library to our brain, which is the most beautiful gemstone of all. When UAH celebrated its 50 years of class, I designed this piece. It's made of sterling silver, 22 karat gold, beautiful sapphires. There's quite a lot of symbolism. For instance, there's a small piece of uh, sterling silver. It represents the small acreage. When we started, we only had the Morton Hall. But now we have many, 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 many buildings. Uh, there's a logo. The logo that UAH had when it started, it's a head looking up to the stars, and that's what happened to the UAH, it went up to the stars. From the very, very small size that UAH was, uh, I designed the centerpiece is made of 50 gemstones. 50 sapphires, colored sapphires, set in 22 karat gold. And that 50 color sapphire represented the 50 years of class, traveling in time and space. From then onwards, UAH is sort of like a rocket. And so I uh, made an 18 karat gold space shuttle, soaring up, leaving a stream of white line, symbolizing UAH's growth and achievement. When the University of Alabama in Huntsville celebrated its 25th anniversary, I designed this triptych sculpture to celebrate this occasion. I compared the UAH with a seed, because everybody knows that when you sow a seed, it's not always that it will germinate. And this seed germinated and grew very strong roots, meaning that UAH came into existence. The second triptych represents the seed blooming. In this seed, we, I put a 19.7 carat uncut diamond to represent UAH, because I felt that at that point, UAH was just like a diamond in the rough. And on this seed, you can see that there are beautiful colored sapphires and diamonds. Those represent the morning dew that nourishes the seed. And in its turn, uh, this uh, beautiful gemstones represent all the people that helped to make UAH grow. The third triptych is UAH that we have today. It became a giant. Here you can see that uh, the, it forms UAH. And on UAH there are lines that represent uh, the path that all the UAH graduates took after they graduated from this university. To commemorate the 25 years uh, of Autonomous University, instead of writing 25, uh, I have designed a brooch that has 25 strands of very beautiful red coral pointing up, representing that UAH is growing very, very fast. And on the top, you can see that there is a piece that's covered with gemstones, six gemstones representing the six eminent scholar chairs. And on the second stage, you will see more gemstones, six more gemstones. Those represent the six schools that UH has.
The uniqueness of these sculptures is that they are a piece of sculpture, but they are also there are also many, many pieces of jewelry in there. For instance, the geode and the treasure chest. The treasure chest can be removed and it is a beautiful necklace. Now for the uh, 25th anniversary, I made it so that there are many, many pieces that can be worn separately. The, the seed in blossom is a pendant or it's a brooch. The piece on the very top of A can be removed. This piece is a very, very ultra-modern pendant. And uh, the six gemstones for the colleges, they are removable, they are earrings. Now the part that uh, represents the 25 years is a brooch. It is worn twisted instead of flat and it's made of sterling silver this piece.